Yo, what's up? It's me, Noetic, here with a Smash video in who knows how long, or at least plan to turn this into a video. Um, I probably haven't played this game for more than two days in like over six months, something like that. Um, the last time I actually played it though was like in January, I think? So, we're gonna be in training mode for- oh, I just realized this is not my attack anymore. Um, I'll change that real quick. And we're back. Anyway, as I was saying, I got my name. Um, I'm just gonna like try and de-rust a little bit on training mode before I start getting my ass whooped by like 50 Steves and 20 Kazuyas. Um, yeah, I'm just gonna play around in this for a little bit and then I'll see you guys soon. I saw about like, I don't know, that was probably like a minute or two later. Um, obviously I cannot de rust in like a minute or two. Also, uh, side note, sorry, Silver. I don't mean to fuck up your boy here. Um, the game just chose Yoshi for me. Also, 69. Nice. Yeah, I'm just gonna hop online. I'm, I'm just gonna do it. Hopefully, my first match isn't Steve or Kazuya or anyone annoying. Honestly though, this is probably, I don't know if this is a hot take, but everybody in this game has some annoying bullshit. Anyway, um, I'm kind of sad. My Toon Link and my Cloud used to have the same exact GSP, but one day I was like, I just want to play Cloud online. So I kind of ruined that, but whatever. Here we go. Oh my god, I hate this game. No, I don't. I actually secretly love it, but... I'm like not good at it, so I get mad when I lose. Okay, Dark Samus, she can be annoying, but so it's, it's a it's whatever. Okay, she's gonna keep forcing me to jump. It looks like at least she's done it twice, and maybe they think that I'm super scrubby, so they're probably gonna keep trying it. And yeah, they keep anti airing like that. Okay, that was nice. By the way, if this video turns out to be just me getting fucked up over and over, um, you know, I'm sorry if you're expecting me to hook people, um, but I am not great at the game. Oh, shit. Also, another thing that kind of just made me stop playing this game is people just winning and dipping, man. They either win and dip, uh, because they whoop your ass or the game is so close That they don't want to fight you again because they're either scared or I don't know Or even if you do beat them You can beat them by so little and then they just don't want to fight you again Or you beat their ass so badly that they leave anyway, like it's so hard to get rematches There you go, so, and they All right first match my ass got three stock. Um, that's always great. <laughs> Yo, why is it taking so long to get me into a damn game? Am I in Smash Hell? You know you know. Man, Smash Hell on Smash 4 was different. <laughs> Yo, you literally got put with like the worst of the worst on that. Like every, if you're in Smash Hell, every other, no, every person would just be the most toxic person and just in their little tags you could switch your name and um they would just be putting the most fucked up like tags ever yo editing me here these are just some examples that i found with a quick search i got them from this twitter thread they will link in the description uh if y'all find any other ones just let me know because i think these are hilarious uh oh the ice climbers on elite you never see that they're already doing these things i'm actually shook it no don't do me like this also another side note um the song playing right now is by my homie matt mims go check him out that song you know what i might replay it shoot i cannot pause the game okay whatever yeah his song just came out called from afar uh out everywhere you know spotify to music youtube i think apple whatever anyway go check it out it's a banger 
Also, please do not judge me for this current song playing. I might cut it out in editing, so I don't want to get bullied. But if I don't, um... Fuck you. Yo, Zane son, can you not do me dirty like this? Okay, I don't really know how to fight Ice Climbers. I think if you knock away Nana, it's similar to like a Rosalina situation. You probably just want to get rid of Nana first. Or like if you have the- obviously you want to get rid of her, but what I'm saying is like if you get a knockback, instead of going for Popo, just like whoop Nana's ass. Damn, that really didn't. Okay. Okay, that was, that was good. That was good. Damn, I'm trash at this game. Oh, dude, I swear, I feel like when they like click ready or whatever that quickly, they just dip. There's no way they stood. Or stayed. Stayed, stood. You know, for a while, I was actually trying, um, like arenas and stuff. But even arenas are toxic. Like, if you're close to winning, they just quit. <laughs> like, get rid of the arena. They, like, delete the arena. It's so annoying. I was gonna say... No, never mind. I was gonna say, um... I've never seen Fountain of Dreams on Quick Play, but... That's literally just untrue. I was gonna say, like, is this a shadow patch? Nice. But it's Ganon, though. Like, I should be edge guarding him like that, man. If my first win is against the Ganon, no disrespect to the Ganon, but like, I'm not gonna feel terribly good about myself. There was this one, no, these two Ganons that would beat my ass, um, back when I used to play this game more seriously, um... I think one of them was named Mustang? And... I might be confusing some. Never mind. I think it was just yeah, just that one Ganon. Um, it's either Mustang or Mustang. They're like a really good Ganon player and would actually annoy the shit out of me because I would just die instantly, especially his Cloud. Like, I just could not edge guard this Ganon for the life of me, and they would always reverse edge guard me too. Um, but yeah, they were really good. I think I still have them on my friends list. If not, then. Dang. But um, I wonder if they still play. I just always love to get that. First win against Ganon. <laughs> Damn, see, look. Like, why did you leave, bro? I want to keep fighting you, man. Marthido! Yo! Let's go! What's good, bread? Okay, yeah. I've never been good at timing that either. Um, I mean, attacks against neutral getups. Like, Spargo is somebody who I notice is really, really good at that with, like, Cloud F tilt. Although, to be fair, the move is decently active, I think. Back throw. Maybe jump in fair. Got him. Damn, that took a while. Moth matches, I feel like, usually tend to take a little bit longer just because they're both trying to, like, space and, like, play safe. Hopefully they stay. I like Moth Dittos. Don't attack again. Oh, you attacked again. Oh, I thought I got my roll off. Or maybe I did, but he, like, caught me in the frames. Oh, where you don't have invincibility. I feel like that's a lot of Marth's go-tos. Like, if you just can't get the kill with anything else because, you know, you're Marth, just throw out a shield breaker, hope for the best. Okay, now I'm missing the text. Don't shield, my brother. Okay. P neutral getups again? I got it. No, I don't. I'm trash. I'm ass. I'm ass. A neutral getup again. He did it again. I'm so bad. I'm so bad at the game. I'm so bad. There we go. Finally. 
I don't really have a goal for this video either. Like, I don't know. I just kind of was bored and was like, you know what? I'm just going to hop on Smash, see what happens. The power of 69? Come on. God damn it. Oh, that was clean. Oh, he dodged it. Got to upbeat early here. Marth and Mario's up B's for that specific reason is um sometimes the game doesn't register that you like intend to turn the up like obviously the up B got turned around right there but what I mean is like there's different angles that Marth's up B can go um so there's practically straight up a little bit diagonal and um as much sideways as it can go and when I did it there, it only did like the turnaround, but it only did the straight up version. And it didn't like launch me as far left as it could have. I don't know if that makes any sense. That shit was clean, dude. That shit was clean. Okay, maybe it wasn't that clean, but it was, it was pretty cool. It's, you know what I'm saying? I'll give myself that. That was a little bit cool. It was a little bit spicy. My parries! Oh, what is happening? Oh! Yo, what is what is going on? Is this Ultra Instinct? Right, let, me, let me let me let me not get let me not get caught up with myself though before I get fucked up. Okay, I think I ran out of Ultra Instinct. I'm only on my Ultra Instinct Omen type shit. You feel me? I still ain't mastered it yet. Damn, he got me. See, this is what I'm saying. Everybody got cocky when <laughs> Goku unlocked Ultra Instinct and then Jiren had to humble his ass real quick. That's what just happened. Damn. Brawl Marth would have gotten that. Oh my god, that was nasty. That was completely intentional. I swear. I was gonna make a joke and put on the cap when I said that. Whatever. Also, on this channel, you will definitely hear a lot of... Um, oh shit, th that light is bad. Um, you will hear a lot of drum and bass. GG's my dude, my dude bread. I hope you be getting that bread. Um, but yeah, GG's. Oh shit, I got the hiccups. No, Kazuya. Ah yes, we're on the testicle stage. Just anytime Kazuya touches you, just assume that you're gonna die. Just, just always assume. Just accept, come to terms with the fact that your stock is going to be gone and move on to your next. Otherwise, you'll just get tilted instantly trying to fight this dude. Nice. Don't air dodge. Oh, you air dodged. Oh shit. Bro, two hits, 41%. What is going on? Don't air dodge. Oh, you're dead, I think. Okay, my phone better die. My phone, 2%. You know that reference? Shout out to you. By the way, stay hydrated. You know what I'm saying? I got two waters on me. Alright, who we got next? Who we got next? Better not be no Kazuya. Better not be Steve. I 
Mahe Bennett. No, 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 Damn it, I got too close. Yo, this man is scaring me, dude. Oh, how did that hit? The IN? Fuck, he read it. It's okay. Shit. Oh, no. I'm SDI. I'm dead anyway. Oh, my fuck. Kazuya Mishima. Wins. Well, that's pretty much it for the video. There's still some more footage from this little session that I had, but for the sake of runtime, I thought I'd stop it there. I had some pretty good matches with a Bowser, and I'll probably end up turning those into a vid as well. But anyways, it's been nice to make a vid after such a long time. And I've said this before, but I'll say it again. I do plan on doing other content other than Smash, such as like Mario 64 ROM hacks, other ROM hacks in general like Zelda, Mario Galaxy, and just variety stuff. I really appreciate if y'all hit that like button and that thing called the subscribe button down there. I don't know. Seems kind of cool. Thank y'all once again for watching and y'all have a damn good one.